What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Mr. Mr. PAC or Sean Suda, however you want to call me or whatever. Uh, on G1 Profiles, it's your boy, uh, PAC Sean. Uh, and this time, I'm back to go ahead and address a couple of issues that on the G1 that I don't know if so many people are, are really tripping off of. Uh, it, it is a couple of issues, but let me go ahead and start with, with the first one. Uh, under the first issue, uh, some people have been having problems with trying to go ahead and get their attachments from uh, their Gmail when they receive pictures or, or uh, a video and stuff like that. Uh, and actually, there's a, there's a couple of things you can go ahead and do about that. If you um, if you go to your market, you'll see a hefty little app called uh, Documents to Go. Uh, standard edition. Note though, this app is going to cost you $19.99, right? It will do everything it says there though. Uh, uh, it does work with MS Word, MS Word and Excel files and, and everything like that. And one of the, one of the things that it can do is uh, you can use the Gmail or other email apps to uh, uh, get your attachments. Go ahead and spend $19.99 on that if you choose to. But what I like to do though, simply instead of going to the uh, the email that's provided you know everybody's got that everybody's got that got the gmail there right there I'm gonna go there we we'll go to your browser when you go to your browser and by the way I'm doing this in real time just to show you show you ease of going ahead and do it what not right uh, what I have done in advance uh, is I, I have went ahead and, and bookmarked uh, uh, my Gmail through that, but but if you haven't bookmarked Mark me yet, easiest way I've seen to go ahead and do it. Let's go to a new screen, right? Uh, hit classic right there. Hey, take you to this screen. Go to Gmail. The way your phone is set up, you won't have to do any of the uh, inner passwords or whatever. It's gonna go straight to your Gmail, right? And uh, in that Gmail, it looks a little bit different than, than what the phone Gmail gives you, right? So you scroll down to whatever your uh, your attachment is, right? I'm gonna pick this one right here. All right, in that attachment, or excuse me, in your email, you'll find your attachment down here. Click on that. And what I've used, just like I said in my earlier video about uh, NESOID, is please go ahead and find Download Crutch in the market. It is free. Uh, there may be a, a couple other programs that you use that will do the same thing, but I, I love Download Crutch. Uh, and at the start, Download Crutch will let you go ahead and load stuff, or excuse me, download stuff straight to your phone, which this is doing uh, right here. Now, being that this file that I'm sending my, or that I'm, uh, that I'm extracting is 8.71 megabytes, this could take a uh, just a second. So, while that's taking a second, I'm gonna go ahead and pause, and I'll be right back. It's gonna seem like, you know, nothing happened. Be right back. All right, so it's almost done. I want to go ahead and take this time here to go ahead and tell you though, depending on how big your file is, uh. That's going to determine how long it will take for go, to go ahead and download, but it, it does download, so you can go ahead and get your attachments off. In this case, this is a video attachment, so I'm going to use uh, Astro to go ahead and see now what I've downloaded. Astro is something great to go ahead and have too, because uh, Astro, you can go ahead and, and manage the files that you have there, like, and go ahead and see everything. I'm going to go to my downloads. Uh... I'm gonna find the video that we just downloaded, which would be right here. Test. I hit it and boom. How's it going, y'all? It's your boy, Mr. McDonald, PAC, sitting in the car waiting on my daughter to get out of school. All right. Now that's how you go ahead and you can get some of your attachments out. Not only will this work for uh, for videos, but it'll work for pictures. It'll work for uh, uh, PDAs or PDFs, whatever those documents are or whatnot. Uh, you go ahead and use the combination of uh, going through your browser, 
with the uh, with the download crush installed, you download it to your SD card. Use Astro or some other type of um, management application to go ahead and find your file, play it from there, view it from there, or whatnot. And that's how you go ahead and get around the whole attachment deal. So I thought that was something great to go ahead and tell people about. So uh, there you go on that.